are cetaceans. Cetaceans are ocean mammals that need to breathe air. They also give birth to baby calves and the mother feeds milk to their calves. There are two groups in cetaceans. The tooth whale and the baleen whale. The tooth whale have dolphins, orcas, narwhals, and sperm whales. That's right. Dolphins and orcas are technically whales too. For today's ocean book, I'm going to focus on the baleen whale. There are 14 baleen whale species, and here are some of them. The blue whale, the biggest animal in the planet, it's actually a gray color, but it looks blue when you look at it from under the water. The fin whale, the second largest whale species after the blue whale. The humpback whale, the sea whale, the gray whale and the full head whale. Blue whale is the largest animal in the planet. They can be up to 30 meters or 100 feet long. It can weigh as heavy as 200,000 kilograms or 441,000 pounds. These are super huge numbers, so how big and heavy are they? The blue whale can be as long as five African elephants. African elephants are the biggest land animal on earth. And how heavy? The blue whale weigh as heavy as 40 African elephants. Wow! The blue whale is also one of the loudest animals on the planet. The number one loudest is the sperm whale. But the blue whale is also super loud. Its sound is louder than the jet engine. While whales can be loud, the calves are not. Scientists have found that humpback whale's calves whisper to its mother using a soft sound. They whisper so that the predators won't hear it. Did you know that orcas can hunt whale calves? Be careful, baby whales! Bullhead whale is the longest living mammal on Earth. They can live for more than 200 years! is the whale's baleen. Whales have baleen plates that look like this, hanging from its upper jaw. Baleen is not a bone. Baleen is made of material called keratin. It's the same as our fingernails or hair. Baleen whales may be big, but they eat small animals like krill, zooplankton, and small fish. So why do baleen whales eat such tiny animals? What about 100 people can fit into a blue whale's mouth? It's because the whale's throat is very small. The biggest thing the blue whale or the humpback whale can swallow is the size of grapefruit. So, what happens if you get swallowed by a baleen whale? Humans are way too big. It would 
Bit us back out. Yay! This actually happened in the U.S. A man was swallowed by a humpback whale, and it spat him out. Amazing, right? Believe whales have two blowholes. One, two. Blowholes are just like our nostrils. Whales will use them to breathe. The humpback whale just jumped out of the water. It's called breaching. Humpback whales like to breach or slap their fins or look on their water and make loud noise. Why? Nobody knows the real reason, but scientists think it can be breaching to get rid of parasites, which are little insects on their bodies, or to send messages to other whales. Hello, how are you? Do baleen whales have paws? Baleen whales are not like dolphins or other tooth whales. They don't really travel in pods, but the cats will stay with their moms for up to eleven months. Some amazing facts about the whale poop. Did you know that the whale poop is good for the ocean? Whale poop gives good nutrients for phytoplankton. Phytoplankton is a tiny ocean algae that other small ocean animals eat, so it's important for the ocean ecosystem. But what's super cool is that. Phytoplankton makes oxygen for even you and me. Most of the Earth oxygen, the air we breathe, comes from the ocean and from these tiny phytoplankton guys. Thank you, whale poop. Hey, and baby whale, time for a quiz. Which one is the blue whale? The blue whale or the sperm whale? That's right, it's the blue whale. What do baleen whales eat? Krill or giant squid? The answer is krill. What is the humpback whale doing here? That's right.